Hey, my lovelies, and welcome back to the channel and episode 10 of Growing Not So Buried Together, Roastian. And our girl is still sick after we saw her the last time. She is getting better. She is feeling dizzy, but she is feeling progressively better. She also had some smooth sipping from um, the orange juice that I made her drink this morning. And right now she's just practicing a little bit of her speech for charisma. But since it's Harvest Fest, I've decorated the house, um, or at least had them put up decorations. And I had Makoa make some tofurkey dinner, because of course Pepper is still vegetarian. So she's not gonna want any tofu, or not tofu, any turkey or chicken or other things that are in a big grand meal. So she... So he made something for her with her in mind, also because he's, she's pregnant, of course, which was not planned. I'm not sure if I want it, but of course we are going to keep it. So he's going to call everybody to the dinner. Let's hope they're going, because when I initially started this episode, which was just five minutes in, nobody wanted to listen to me. They didn't do anything. They didn't want to do anything. They got stuck doing things and I had to restart so let's hope that everything goes well now seems like it are you coming home for the grand meal I think I'm going to just have her call to grand meal as well and see if this also works for her to take it off but yeah, I think it would be nice to see everybody have like a nice family dinner. I think most are sitting here. Miguel has already finished. And today should also be prom. So we may go into prom. I'm not sure if prom works with Harvest Fest. But there are a lot of gnomes over here. So we are going to talk to these gnomes. They're also the gnomes that we had from the first Harvest Fest in this series. And they have decided to fully disappear and end up here. So I have to check with the image that I have how to please these gnomes. Although I do think it's funny to also just see and figure out what would happen if we give them certain things. But I think it would be nice to have the seeds to maybe use in a different generation. So I'm just gonna check real quick on my phone. There we go. Um, what we need to do, so for the Grim Reaper one, we have to give the pie for the little cube one, let's call it like that. We have to give a toy, then the these two and this one over here, we have to give, I think we have to give them coffee. So why don't we have everybody pick out their own gnome and give the gnome something? So let's appease the gnome. Oh, she actually wants to critique work. So why don't you critique the gnome first? And then appease the gnome by... What did I say? This one... Pie? And you can... You don't have to eat the dinner again. Um... But I just want to make sure that she had the interaction done. Um, we already had the first one selected. This one needs a toy, so I think one of the kids should do it. This one also needs a pie. Let's do that Haley give this one. Not pie, a toy. And you can give... This one, a coffee. And you can give this one coffee. And let's see if this does work for everybody. If they're gonna do it. And you also still need a gnome. So why did you give this one coffee as well? And let's see if everybody has their own gnome. Is it gonna work? Okay, he's gonna give this one coffee. The toy worked. Coffee worked. The I think this worked for everybody and it takes off the gnome part, so that means that she has a good harvest fest or should have a good harvest fest after 
she is done appeasing the gnome. Um, you are finished up, so you only need to do a thankful spirit. Why don't you be thankful to your older sister, then? And, ooh, a lot of seed package over here. So, let's see. Oh, she's still sick. Um, friendly activities. Compliments. How can I be thankful? I want to be thankful. Okay. I am, I figured mostly out what the new pie menu is. But there are still some things that I don't always know. So I cannot find be thankful right now. And it's not updated here. Um, so you don't see like where you can actually find this. Which makes it a lot more difficult. But let's see. Can we find a way? It's not an... Oh, it's an infection. Never mind. I found it. So be thankful. Do you... You have... A, you already have the grand meal. So it should be ticking off. And you just need to be thankful too. So why don't you be thankful to... Your wife then? Because now we know that it's an infection. And we got the pop-up that there is a little get-together before prom. So why don't we join and choose some of our friends to join with us. So... Do we have... Did our friends age up or did we lose our friends? Because Crazy and Gina are our friends, I know that. Rory is of course a friend. These two, we have had some... Apparently this one is our friend. Mason I think is a friend of Rory's, but where is Mercedes for example? I think some of our friends have actually aged up already and we still have a week to go, which is a bit sad because I was planning on potentially having Rory get together with Mercedes. Why don't we invite Casey and just some people that she already knows? And I need to reset her height because she is still a small girl, even though she should be a regular teen already. Hmm... I think that's it. And I have to take out some CC because I see a lot of people being generated with the scars. So I either need to do some checking if I can uh, change the since for studio. That's what word I was looking for. Or if I need to do something else. But we're just gonna let a few people join. Um, not a lot. I think Stuart is also a friend of Rory, so we should give him a friend, even though he's gonna go into um, Scout soon. Is there anybody else that he is friends with? Because I want him to have some friends to hang out as well. Mm, I'm gonna check real quick and then I'll see you guys once we're there at the get together. Okay, so we have arrived at the Koch household, which is where London lives. And I gave a makeover to a few people um, who we also have relationships with or who Rory has relationships with. So we know Kiana, for example, she's a friend of ours. So why don't we talk to her a little bit? And I know she's still sick, but I love this outfit on her and I love how she looks. She looks so much more grown up and she looks so... Much more like an older teen. But we are gonna ask relationship status because she wants to do that. And we're just gonna hang out a little bit. I think Rory's gonna head into his scout session soon. Oh. She wants. Okana. Do you like Kiana? Wait, she wants to flirt after she's been broken up with. Basic looking. She thinks her pretentious. We think she's adventurous. Um, which fits because she does have the adventurous trait. But we could do a little hookup if she wants to. We're going to discuss her embarrassing mood as well. But if she wants to hook up, we can. Shippy. 
But yeah, there's a lot of people over here um, also going to have Rory take some pictures with his mm -hmm. best friends, Sam and Stuart. So he's just going to take some pictures in the meantime as well, right before he goes into into his um, into his session. And I think it would also be cute oh. if she doesn't have the twirly oh. whirlies again, uh, uh. again to take some pictures with her as well because she looks amazing and she should have some nice pictures too. Oh, and I just see that her twirly whirlies are gone. So why are you saying goodbye to this girl? She's still sick, but she's looking better. So that's at least good. And she wants to ask, do you like what you see? Okay, we're <laughs> we're gonna do this. Um, it can also be something that you can tell your friends. Um, does she have a crush now? Don't tell me she already has a crush. This girl falls... She's smitten. This girl falls in love so fast. And she's actually now flirting. Which... Okay, if that's what you want to do, then fine. You can ask this girl to go to prom with you. Um, but this this girl, like I know she's romantic and she's supposed to be romantic, but she's also gonna claim to be prom royalty. But she's also gonna ask Yana to go to prom together. We're gonna do as friends, but it can if. It evolves into something more. It will evolve into something Good more. Uh, but at least she's feeling a lot better. She does have a so fire sea violation, which I'm getting a lot, even though okay. it shouldn't happen. She's feeling progressively better, but she is headachy. Uh -huh. <laughs> so I think I'm going to have her. Oh, she wants to go to prom with us. Okay, that's great. Why don't we then take a picture together as well? And I am going to have her grab some orange juice and we'll see what we can do in the meantime with everybody here. I'm not sure if there's much we can do. And I love this house, to be honest. It's so big and so well decorated. But let's hope that there's some few stuff that we can do with the rest of the kids. So they actually have something to hang out. And Ash is the one who lives here? Okay. So she's from a high school pack and she lives here and actually is part of this family. Okay, that's great. But do we have any place where we can actually... Where are we? Don't remember where we are because I don't recognize this. I don't recognize this neighborhood. To be honest, but I'm looking if there's like some spot where we can chill a bit more and hang out and have a little bit more of a teen hangout. But I think this is Brindleton Bay actually, but I haven't been in this area of Brindleton Bay. Looks nice. And she... She needs some fun. Yeah, I think we're in Brindleton Bay, but she needs some fun. So keep talking to Kiana. Maybe... Why don't you ask to be pushed on the swing by Kiara and grab some orange juice afterwards as well. Oh, and this is looking really sweet. She's being pushed on the swing. You can actually see her smiling so much. Oh, I think it's really sweet to have that interaction. And I think it's helping her fun too, which is great. So I took a little small little picture, but where is everybody gone to? Because we have these two here, but these two live here. And London is the one who invited us. Rory, of course, we know is at Scouts uh, right now. But where is everybody that we invited as well? Are they hanging over here? No, they're not. I have no idea where everybody went. If they want to leave already, then... We're not gonna stop them, but it would have been nice if they stayed a bit longer. And in the meantime, we're just gonna keep chatting with Kiana and also introduce ourselves to London as she invited us and wait until we actually have prom. <laughs> and I noticed that Kelsey was actually in the neighborhood, so I was checking what she was doing. And she actually married Marcus, who was one of their co-workers. 
So it's nice to see that she found love too. I don't think she has any kids to be honest. Let's check an MCC. Oh, she has two kids. Wait, we have to ch go to Kelsey and Nadia so we can actually Goblin. see what's happening. And there's so many strays here. A cat called Fish. Uh, I want to get another cat, but we don't have space with the baby coming. Hmm. But she's not taking a picture with Kiani, even though I asked her a few times. So maybe the photo camera helps to take a picture instead. And can you drink the orange juice so you have a little bit of a better health? But take a picture with Kiana and we'll see how it goes. Ooh, this pose is looking fire. Let's see if we can get another pose. Romantic. That's cute too. Like that one. Mm, I love these post replacements, but I think I'm going to download some different replacements just because I've been seeing these so many times. But this one is looking fire, so of course we're gonna use this post for the picture that she's gonna oh, hang up in her yeah. walls. Oh. You're not sick anymore, so you should be feeling better now, but... Oh, her, she has her eczema. Is there anything that she can do about it? Actually, I may need to check if there's something that she can do, but... Uh, but I guess we're going to prom first. So we are gonna go to prom, and I'll see you guys there. And it's time for prom. She does need to go to the toilet first, so let's do that. And what do you, you're fine. Why don't you go talk to somebody you know? Stuart is here, so why don't you go talk to him? And what do we actually need to do for prom? Let's... Um... Have a deep conversation with him first. We have to dance, vote for prom royalty, and grab a drink. Okay. So she's gonna go to the toilet first, and then we're gonna vote for prom royalty. Um, who? I think she's gonna vote for her brother. And then for Chester, she she's gonna vote for his friend to see if they can end up together. And I think he is gonna be nice and vote for... His sister as royalty, and then as a jester for Stuart as well. So I think Stuart may win prom royalty. And she is in the same dress as she was last time, but I actually had a different dress for her in mind this time. So let me quickly go into MCC center and change her with the dresser. So I actually had... This dress in mine is dead, so it's a little bit of a longer dress, it's a bit of a more mature look. Less glittery, and I think it looks again amazing on her. And since we need to dance as well, she's gonna go to the toilet, she's then gonna grab some fruit punch, and he's gonna be the one doing some dancing. And she just looks so beautiful, I'm sorry for my chair, but she is so stunning and i still don't know how we were able to get this beautiful girl here because she is amazing um we've done a lot of things we need to gossip with somebody and these two are sweetheart dancing can we find kiana to gossip with her instead i also want her to take some pictures in the photo booth with kiana but where is kiana actually I'm not seeing her. Oh, there she is. So, can we take some pictures and why don't you two gossip together? And they've built up their friendship a lot, actually. Wow. It's been going up very, very fast. And apparently Rory likes to dance, which is great. But he's gonna grab something to eat first, and what are your photos looking like? Can you please show me, girl? Um, 
let's see. Do we have the picture somewhere in here? Okay, this is a poor quality picture, so we're gonna delete that. But do we have the photo booth picture somewhere, or do I have to wait? Oh, there it is. Let's see. I think that's a cute picture. I think that looks nice. She is a bit... She's feeling it not that great. She is still itchy from her eczema. But we do have to dance, actually, and gossip with somebody. So I think I did order you to gossip, or order, did tell you to gossip with Kiana. So why don't you kiss her neck? Okay, I'm gonna kiss her neck. Uh, wanted her to gossip with Kiana, but we're gonna kiss her neck instead. And we are gonna show off our outfit as well, if we can. It's actually working? She is so smooth. I think she's gonna ace through um, the, the aspiration that she needs to do. But let's see, how can we... Oh, Ooh, the ceremony is beginning. Okay, I'm gonna check how we can do show off the outfit later. But right now it's going not too bad. She's gonna dance afterwards, but it's it's going good. I think Rory's also having a nice time. He's feeling inspired, he's feeling happy. But who actually ended up being from royalty and from Jester? Let's see. <gasps> She actually won! Our girl is from royalty! This is the first time I actually had anybody be from royalty. So, I'm so happy for... Like, she now has her crown, she is cheering, she is looking so happy. It's not the best pose, but... Let's see if I can take a better picture. But look how happy she is. Look how excited she is. That she is from royalty. Oh, beautiful queen. She is royalty, that is for sure. Because she is looking like a queen. She is looking amazing. And I think it's also thanks to her brother voting for her and her brother helping her out. He's now changed it to his regular clothes. I don't think he really likes the suit that much. But she is gonna... I think she's gonna do a little bit of gossiping with him. Because of course it would be nice for them to have a little bit of a fun time too. So she's gonna share a secret with him that she kissed Kiana's neck. And then I'm gonna check how she can show off the outfit. But maybe we can do also a little bit of dancing... Let's do a sweetheart dance with Kiana, actually. And she's actually also taking a picture with her brother in the photo booth because I think they don't have really any pictures together aside from the ones that I took with them posing. So I want them to take some in-game pictures too and then she is gonna dance uh, with Kiana and he is gonna eat something. So I don't think he had anything to eat and... We need to make sure that we keep doing these things. But prom is complete. We earned a shiny reward because we had a silver. And there's an after party. Who's asking us? Okay, we don't know this person. And he's asking Worry. So he's gonna invite over his sister, I would say, Stuart and Harjo. And... Uh, Ruby is also gonna invite over Kiana, but we're gonna just invite over the whole gang, basically. And since we have a little bit of romance with Kiana, we're gonna do a romantic ride with her. And see how she responds. In the meantime, Rory is gonna introduce himself to some of the people. Because he has a few friends, but not really. She's actually very sad. He thinks she is admirable. And he perceives her as attractive, but she does think he's annoying because she is a friend, of course, of her, of his sister. But he's just gonna talk to Gina, he's gonna talk about her, he's gonna console her about death. Like, I can understand that you're not feeling too happy about being here, um, but I hope you're 
at least having some fun. And he's just gonna do a little bit of empathizing. He's open with his alien abilities, so I think he would use them as well. And he's just gonna do a little bit of chatting with her and see what happens. I think he saw her looking sad and pretty at the same time. So he may have done a little bit of a little bit of talking to her. And we'll see you know what these two do in the color cards, like how it's going. I think it would be interesting to see what happens. But if nothing happens between these two, it's fine. I think um, she's not really looking for love. I think she's more looking for a distraction. And Kiana is there. She doesn't perceive Kiana as attractive or anything. Um, she actually perceives Kiana as basic looking. So I think in that case, it's more of her trying to be a little bit out there trying to going to uh, get on this in a second trying to be a little bit more open with her heart so she has so she can get over molly but ruby wants to make the perfect romantic atmosphere and thought the color cards would be the best way what she wasn't expecting was just how cheesy the ride would be which isn't exactly the vibe she was going for. She looks at Kiana and tries to gauge her, gauge, 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 gauge her attraction, gauge her reaction. She can tell if she's into the corny atmosphere or not. Does Ruby poke fun at the ride and add some flirt, the banter to try and make the moment a little bit more romantic, or does she embrace the cheese and attempt to show Kiana's slice of playfulness? I think she's gonna lean into the atmosphere actually, and. They lost romance, unfortunately. But something awakens within Ruby and the cheese is starting to spoil with the over ex except your Okay, I can never pronounce that word. Of her performance. Kiana was excited at first, but the interpretive dance, for lack of better term, that Ruby was attempting completely ruined the mood. Unfortunately, Ruby was too far gone and the god of cards have created a monster. A singing dancing monster is nearly isn't nearly as cute as it sounds. Ruby thinks the right was going was went great and is ready to keep the flirty vibes going without realizing that Kiana has already started to block out the right from her memory. Oh, not the best thing, girl. But maybe we can get a little bit of romance back. Maybe? We'll see. Uh, why don't you write this with Ruby in... Uh, with Ruby with Kiana instead. And... Are you still talking to Gina? Why don't you do a little bit more talking to Gina? She's still looking sad, so I think he's still gonna do a little bit of more talking. Uh, asking maybe about her hobbies, what she likes to do. Just to see, like, what's going on. And she's gone. So, we are going to talk to Stuart instead. We're going to congratulate him with being the jester. And we're, so, I think we can give him some props. And then we're also going to just do a little bit of talking with our best friend instead, I think. So, why don't we do a secret scouting handshake? Because apparently uh -huh. he's also in scouts. And you are... Oh, you lost romance, but you think she is still adventurous, she's or still smitten. Baba. And we're gonna see if we can get a little bit of that romantic atmosphere back between the two of them. It doesn't have to be girlfriend, like it can also count towards her having kissed some few people. It can be a little bit of a flirtation. Maybe something more happens in the future, but right now I don't think she really wants anything serious and she just wants to have a little bit of fun <laughs> and that's okay if that's what she wants to go yeah, with yeah. that's 100 percent fine it's the next morning and we actually get a pop-up that makoa wants to embrace being a bookworm okay of course you can embrace it our girl is eating going to the toilet and is going to eat some breakfast so why don't you get some leftovers? We have a very angry Miguel here because biking is hard and he's overheating. So I'm quickly going to use MCC 
to put him in a colder outfit. Because, of course, we don't want our little kids to die. We have Haley over here doing a little bit of stargazing. She's now actually very doing pretty well on her creative activity. She's almost done. She just needs to sleep in a treehouse for six hours. So why don't you do that, actually? By... Because you need, you need some energy. You can use it. And what I think we're going to do today... Pepper is in the third trimester. She is having a burnout or bur uh, a brain block. She is not doing well. She... She... She's just not doing well. So what I think would be best is to have a little bit of a family moment. And actually have her go into... Uh, or have all of them go into one of the places. Maybe do a nice time. Maybe just have a little bit of family bonding. Because I think it would be good for them to actually do something fun and not just stay at home all the time so we're gonna wait until Rory wakes up and everybody is in a good mood before I'm going to have them do a little bit of family bonding all right so I thought it would be fun to go to the park since it is a sunny day so we are here at the recreation center that I think Sims 4 IDs build since we now have some kids so they can actually enjoy the little kids park and I think we're gonna start off with a little bit of adding slope and then trick sliding with your brother and your other brother. And I think these two, they would love a little bit more of a yoga session. So do we actually... We can request a yoga instructor. So we are gonna request a yoga instructor and we're gonna then have a session for these two, and I think Makoa is... Oh, hmm, what's Makoa gonna do? I'm not sure, actually. I think he loves to work out always, but he needs to use the toilet first, so why don't you... Use the toilet first, actually. Oh, he's already doing that. And then maybe do a little bit of working out. As I know, that's something that he really likes to do. So use the toilet and then work out oh and she's feeling so tense but we have the yoga instructor here so she is gonna talk to the instructor and ask for let's see what can we ask for can we not do anything does ruby have to do it since she's the one who actually hired the instructor yes as to start yoga class uh family friendly so she's gonna join the yoga class right now. And I think Pepper is also gonna join and everybody else is just gonna have fun with the water slide. I know we have a water slide at home, but I think this is a lot more fun to also go a little bit out um, and do some other more fun things. But she is ready to start the class. Can I actually join the class? Hmm. Can she not? Oh, she cannot do yoga while pregnant. Oh, that's so sad. I actually wanted her to do a little bit of yoga to relax. But why don't you then relax over here and use this as a little bit of a fun time? And apparently Rory oh. thinks his idea of fun is researching plants. Yipsy. Whereas Yipsy. these two are... <laughs> Still doing a little bit of trick shots on. Oh, that looked painful. That looked very painful. But he's gonna trick slide. And these two are just gonna have some fun playing around. Um, I think Ruby is gonna join a yoga class because she actually likes yoga. And we have a little bunny over here. Where did you come from, little one? Where did you come from? Aww. Bunny was so cute, but I think everybody's just gonna do a little bit of working out, playing around, chatting with each other, 
and just have a fun, nice day not being inside the house. She looks like it's helping relax. Looks like her relaxation is a little bit helping. I'm not gonna have her garden because she hates gardening. But at least it looks like it's working a bit. And I wish I could have had her done a yoga routine because I think it would really help. But she wants to play. She actually reached the top of her aspiration. So I'm now checking to see if we can draw some pictures. She's not inspired, but maybe it will bring her into an inspired mood. Or you can play... Oh, here we can draw the pictures. So why don't you draw an animal? And Rory is of course gardening, but I think it would also be fun if maybe because we have the lake over here, very close by, maybe we can do a little bit of fishing with your little brother. You can teach him how to fish and show you everything um, that you have learned in scouting. So I think that would be fun to do. And what is... He? Oh, he feels so embarrassed from trick test of fee. Hmm, poor baby. But she's doing her yoga session in sur being surrounded by animals. And I think it's... Like, I'm not going to focus on her having to do a lot of yoga. But I think it's nice for her to sometimes use it as a way of... Um, winding down doing something different and i'm also gonna have her do an odd job because i still want to try to reach the top of this aspiration i'm not sure we can but we can always check and she's also gonna cross promote at the venue because she's here now so why shouldn't she do it and then after that she's gonna find an odd job and work on that one and i do think it's nice you see them in their <laughs> in their swimming trousers uh, just having some fun time. So I'm gonna take a picture of these two together. Because they're, they're brothers. They may not be from the same father. They may not be the same age. But they are still brothers. They are still family. And he is actually ripped. But I think it's nice to see them spending time. Same with Ruby and Rory and Ruby Haley. Like it's nice to see all of them just having a little bit of a fun time and actually seeing them build up that family bond. I think it's really important. And I think she is going to help Yasminder with packing up some boxes because she doesn't have handiness. So those two three won't work. She doesn't earn that much money from this and I don't think she has a mixology level. So we're going to do this one. And we'll see how it goes. Are you going into it? And Miguel's... Oh, Miguel's not being good at fishing. I think he feels a little bit embarrassed. So he's gonna confess his embarrassing moments. And you need to use a toilet, actually, but you want to stretch. So I'm just gonna have them do what they want to do. While... She is going into her odd job and she's also talking with Haley. Oh, she's actually coming over to talk with her sister. So that's really sweet that you see her actually bonding with her sister and wanting to bond with her sister. Well, unfortunately, we are going to do the packing. She's already half an hour late. And Rory is getting a call from Stuart. Um okay. I think he's gonna ask for permission to go because he's not the sneaking out type. But can we actually have him sneak out? Oh, sneak out to the movies. I think he's gonna sneak out because they're supposed to have a family moment. Miguel's the only one who's here right now. So he's gonna try and sneak out. And you are actually going to discipline your child for making a mess and realizing Rory is gone. And maybe discipline him too. So she's going to be... She's tense, so typically she wouldn't yell. But since she's been experiencing a burnout, since she's been experiencing so much tenseness, she's going to yell at her son. And oh, I... 
don't know what's happening here. That was looking really, really weird, and I don't want to ever see that again. So, I think this girl is so cute for playing. But she's gonna put that little kitty in her inventory. And then she is gonna do another painting. So hopefully she can get a little bit more expired or expired inspired. But I think she's also gonna create a friendship bracelet that she can give to Miguel. Because I think it would be good. Really, really cute if she exchanges bracelets with her brother. Stop making a mess, young man. Stop making a mess. Can you please discipline his behavior? So, success. Yes, mine was a little high maintenance. Back this here. No, I want this in that box. Make sure the boxes aren't too heavy. Even still, where we followed all the exceptions. It took all day, but the packing was do got done and the client was pleased. And that is all that really matters, isn't it? Oh, also money. So she got 84 simoleons. Haley is learning how to play the piano. And everybody is going a bit home. He is snuck out to the movies and... He was actually, and he's feeling energized by it, but I think everybody's gonna head home. I think we're gonna call it a day. And I think I'm also going to end the episode here. Uh, there, ha a lot has happened, not really in terms of progress with Ruby maybe, but she is gonna age up soon. So in a few days on Friday, she is going to age up into young adults. I am going to ask you guys, is, because she is eligible for early graduation, and she has been a teen for a long time, I feel, because it's now 10 episodes in, and she is still a teen. Would you guys like me to age her up early and graduate early and have her go to university sooner? Because you guys did vote for her to go to university. So I'm... I'm fine with aging her up on Monday or Tuesday instead of aging her up on Friday. It will be in the same week, but a few days earlier. And then already have her start looking into university. Otherwise, we'll wait for Friday and have her start university in the, the week after. But of course, we do have to take into consideration that she has to prepare for university a few days. So if we want to start on Monday anyways, I think we may need to age her up a bit earlier. So let me know in the comments down below and also on the poll that I would do on Twitter. If you guys are fine with me aging her up a bit earlier, I may also lower down the time that teenagers are teenagers because I think 21 days is really long on a normal time span. I think it used to be 15 days. So I think I may age it, may change that back to 15 days. So we don't have a long time staying in one lifespan and not really focusing on the not so berry rules. I do think it was really nice to have her go to prom, win prom, spend a little time with the family abroad, having her do yoga. Uh, so I think it's nice to also have the time for non-rule gameplay. But I also do want to move forward with this challenge and see like what she will do in university, how she will deal with Molly. We now see her also starting to look at some other people, like with Kiana, for example. So we'll, we'll see how it goes. But again, let me know in the comments down below. If you guys like this episode, click that little like button down below. If you're not subscribed yet and don't want to miss out on the series, don't want to miss out on either wholesome or completely chaotic video, make sure you click that subscribe button. And I'll see you lovelies in the... Next one. I found you in.